that if you ever possess me again, I'll, I'll, you have no right to dump your unfinished business Hold on. on me. Now, I'm tracking down my killer, okay? Someone who was seconds away from attacking you about an hour ago, and if... Wait a minute. You, you can see me and hear me? <sighs> Holy shit. You're a medium. <laughs> well, I ain't, ain't I the luckiest guy in the world? I just found the perfect little helper. What is it with you guys and my family? Helping the cops do their job is not some, some privilege. It's a trap. I'm not your informant, your partner, or your friend. I don't owe you. If anything, you owe me. Dick. Yeah, yeah, I, I get it. You're tough, okay? But you're not tougher than him. You saw what he can do. He's coming after you or someone close to you. Whoever he wants dead is lucky to still be alive. Now, I know what I'm doing, and you can help me stop him. All you have to do is answer some questions. Look, I'm sorry. What happened to you was horrible, and you, you saved my life, so what do you want? I was murdered tracking that son of a bitch to your place, so why would he be looking for you? That freak was probably looking for my mom, not me. I I'm a nobody. Invisible. My mom and I tried very hard to keep it that way. Not everybody wants to be noticed, you know. Looking for your mom. What does that mean? She's like me, but she found a way to make a respectable living off of what we can do. Living that probably turned her into a target. So where's your mom, kid? Probably dead. She would never just leave me without saying a word, never. I don't know where she is. I know the bell killer had something to do with her disappearance. Him showing up tonight just proves it. If he killed her, why would he come back to her place? Hmm. I don't know. Look, assuming the worst never helped no one. Why don't you live there? Because of people like you always asking for help. Trying to connect one last time with your loved ones or, or resolve some crazy problem. I love my mom, but I can't live in one place for too long or people like you will find me too easily. I wasn't home much either growing up. I know that's rough. All right, all right. What were you doing at your apartment? I live there, Sherlock. Well, I used to, whatever. My mother has been missing for a few days. I, I don't see her that often, but she never just disappears. Not like this. Respectable living? Yeah. Hey, you might know her. She was working the bell killer case for the cops as a contract psychic. A profiler. Sorry, kid. She didn't ring any bells. I found this in the apartment tonight. Mentioned something about some bell killer book. And it's in her handwriting. Bell killer book. If she was a profiler, it's probably the book she kept all her case notes in. That would be at the station. Really? Have you ever seen my killer before tonight? Do you have any idea who he is? 
You cops are so hard up on clues that you're actually asking people if they know who the killer is. Now I get why you need so much help. I'm not asking people. I'm asking the witness whose life I just saved. You're not safe alone. You need someone watching over you. Us cops find missing people. I found you and I can help you find your mom. Your problem is now my problem too. No way. Uh, don't get me wrong, you saved my life and... Okay, I can't pay that back, but your problems are your problems and mine are mine. There they are. Good luck. You're gonna need it. Have a nice afterlife. Oh, wait a minute. Don't go yet. Just stop for a second, will you? We're on the same side. If your mother's involved, we need to work together. Work together? What are you gonna do? You're dead. I'll handle it. Just leave me alone! I bet she knows more. I can't let her get away. There's gotta be another way down. Brian is a lovely boy, but I worry about his family. Well, his mother does seem to be a bit of a heartbeat, but Brian's worth it. Yeah, I think so too, dear. It's just that Shelley didn't grow up around boisterous people, and I worry about the pressures of their relationship. Fine, you know they'll have a long, happy life together. Oh, I'm sure you're right. Leaving so soon, dear? Yeah, sorry. Uh, I'll be back. Don't wait up, Father. Be careful out there, my child.
think that evil bastard is going to be... Now what? <laughs> 